tropical rainforests are found right around the equator, South American tropics, uh, equatorial Africa, and of course, Southeast Asia. The Malaysian rainforests are among the oldest anywhere in the tropics. They support incredible levels of diversity. In the UK, for example, we have 30 indigenous species of trees. In a single hectare of Malaysian rainforest, you might find 300 species of tree. So these forests support fantastic levels of biodiversity. The forests of rainforests of Malaysia are also the tallest in the tropics, with a canopy regularly more than 60 meters in height, uh, with the very tallest emergence being 80, 90, and even 100 meters tall. We recently identified a tree in Sabah, so the northern part of Borneo, uh, that was over 100 meters tall, making it the tallest tree yet discovered in the tropics, and probably the tallest flowering plant anywhere in the world. Tropical rainforests occupy about 5% of the land area of the Earth, and yet they account for almost 50% of biodiversity. The rainforests have a very high canopy, and there are multiple layers beneath that canopy, providing a great deal of habitat complexity and many ecological niches. So that structural complexity, combined with the very high diversity of plant species, means that rainforests support extremely high levels of biodiversity. So thousands of species of plants, hundreds of thousands of species of invertebrates, hundreds of species of birds, dozens and dozens of species of reptile and mammal and so forth. So these are the most complex systems that have ever evolved. The relationship between the species in forest, the sort of web of life, is extremely complex and important. Rainforests play a crucial role in mitigating climate change, so they and absorb from the atmosphere very large quantities of carbon. They play a crucial role in protecting water catchments and not to be uh, forgotten, they also support the livelihoods of many forest dwelling communities. It's absolutely crucial that the existing primary rainforests of Malaysia are protected. It's also very important that forest that has been degraded by logging, by plantation development, by hunting and so forth, is restored. So much of Malaysia is covered by forest that has been selectively logged and it's very important that that's, that forest is allowed to recover and where necessary we take steps to restore that forest by planting trees and so forth. Actions that improve the quality of the forest and its ability to sequester carbon from the atmosphere and to support very high levels of biodiversity.